38, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Cool. How's it going, everybody? It's Brandon, a.k.a. Dinos here, back for episode 38 of our Pokemon Platinum half Blind Challenge. In the last episode, you guys, we went into the Sunny Shore Gym and defeated the leader, Vulcaner. Yeah. The dealer that he is. Um, and I went to go start the episode on the, the sandy part. To hey, look, guys. It was look, it was I, look nice. We're, we're also joined here today by Joel and... Andy! And he's in the background. Yeah, and he's kind of in the background. He's just yeah. kind of showing up. You we didn't interrupted him. my intro. <laughs> I mean, you kind of forgot to introduce. I was people. going to at the end. I'm oh, kind of uh... because I was going to tie it in because Joel's right there. Hey, do you I know was going to tie it in. You have no fucking faith in me. I'm kind of irrelevant in this, so <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really need an introduction. And, and Andy's, Andy's like, "Mommy and Daddy are fighting again." <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dinos. What the? <laughs> fuck are you doing here? <laughs> <laughs> you went and got all eight gym badges and said, oh, oh, you. Not oh, you. <laughs> That's wicked. I envy you. But don't think you've won. Because I'm going to be... I'm not going to be the toughest trainer ever. Watch me fuck up. Before I was dreaming, I just wanted to be like me dad. Dad? 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 Now things are different. I thought about what being a trainer involves. I thought about what Pokemon are. Oh my god. We're going to get tougher. We're not going to get tougher one step at a time. I'm not going to challenge you to a battle now, because I'm terrible. I hate to say it, but I know you're tougher than me. But a lot tougher. Just a lot. Our difference about is about 150 yards. Eh, maybe like a mile. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is that I won't catch up to you at any time. If you don't hurry to the Pokemon League, I... Eh, I got nothing for that. Okay. Cool, Joel. What the hell is this bitch? Jasmine, we talked to her like two episodes ago. <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> Was that your friend? He's dreaming. Seeing how he... You already made that joke. Yeah, well, you know. Seeing, I'm bringing it back. Seeing how you two get along made me happy somehow. It must be wonderful having a friend like that. A friend who just demeans himself. Yeah. Constantly. A person that you could share life? anything and everything with. A person you could compete without fighting. Um, it made me feel sort of warm seeing Ooh. you two. It got me horny. It may, it may seem odd, but I'd like you to have this as my thanks. This isn't much, but you obtained HMO7. Waterfall, because it what made, it made a... What fucking do? She's giving us Waterfall because she had a Waterfall in her pants. Uh, if, you, if you use it, <laughs> you can get to the Pokemon League. Um, I, don't, I don't know how I should say this, but good luck. You don't know how to say good luck? Just say good luck! She said it, so... <laughs> so, here's the problem. I don't know that someone in our party can learn Waterfall. Do you not have a water site? Ah, uh, I, I wasn't sure if Eevee could learn it, but... They can learn it, so... We're probably gonna get rid of Quick Attack. So... We can now have Waterfall. Yay! So now, in today's episode, you guys, we're going to head towards uh, Victory Road. Okay. All right. As usual, we're joined by... <laughs> I don't like you. I really don't like you. <laughs> oh, man. So, Joel. The fuck? It's a little mini -on. It's irrelevant. Okay. Um, remember how uh, a couple episodes ago... We were talking about something, we were like, oh, we were going to tell a story, but we don't remember what it is. Yeah, I still don't remember what it is. I do. It was a story on what, uh, on, uh, there's mad people here. Oh, right, that the party. Yeah. Uh, that happened. So you want to tell that story yeah, for us sure. while we're going through this route? So I was down at school, and my friend called me while he was at a party, and he's like, yo, Joel, come through, there's mad people here. And I just, being a sarcastic asshole... 
It's just like, oh, well, is there going to be a fight? It's just like, no, what are you talking about? Why is everyone so angry? What the fuck are you talking about? You said there were mad people here. I didn't just like, why is everyone so salty? <laughs> he paused for like five seconds and then he told me not to come anymore. <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, that's a pretty good story. Yeah. Hey, listen. At least, at least you were invited, right? Yeah. Well, I showed up anyways. Well, of course. <laughs> at that point, you kind of have to. Yeah. Were you pissed that you showed up? No, he didn't care. Okay. He just kind of gave me like a sigh. <laughs> wow. That that's funny. Did I ever tell you about the, uh, when I was in, I think I told you this story, Joel, but one time when I was at, uh, when I was at school, I was walking upstairs to my, uh, to my floor, and I get onto the floor, I open the door, I open the, into the floor, and, and I, someone threw a grapefruit at you. How'd you know? No. <laughs> no that's a different story. <laughs> that's, that's a story for another day. <laughs> um, so, uh. I, I looked up and I looked at the end of the hallway and there's like a window at the end of the hallway and uh, I looked and uh, there's a guy like hunched over it was like one of my neighbors he was hunched over the, like the windowsill and I'm like Are you party too hard is he gonna be okay like what's happening here jump so I, wa I walked over to him and I'm like yo you all right and he goes yeah dude I'm fine. Oh, this is the Molly kid. Yeah, he's like, he was like, you sure? And he goes, yeah, yeah, I just did Molly for the first time today, and I'm like, oh, jeez, all right, so you must be pretty fucked. He's like, yeah. <laughs> but, oh, Molly's sweating. Uh, he, I, I don't know if he was sweating. We were, uh, we were in, we were in Maine at the time, and it was like November. Well, when you pop so, Molly, it doesn't matter. You gotta be sweating. Still sweating. <laughs> if you're not sweating, did you actually pop the Molly? It's no. a, a great question, Joel. It's a great question. In the comments. <laughs> yeah, let us know. Let us know. Let us know if it is possible to pop a molly and not sweat. <laughs> oh, that's so stupid. How'd you heal? You pop molly and you don't sweat. It's surrounded itself with water. Oh, use Aqua Ring. I got you. I was too busy paying attention to Andy's stupid face. Sorry. Because he's a stupid face. Yeah, pretty stupid. You're pretty dumb. I know. Dumb stupid face. I'm so stupid. So dumb. Got a dumb stupid face, so I call him dumb stupid. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> skirt, 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 skirt. <laughs> god, we're dumb. Yeah. It's getting almost as weird as Destiny. Almost as. Dude, there was. I don't know. I think it's like two weeks from now. Or, well. It'll probably be this week's episode at the top for like the day this goes up. Can you be confused and asleep? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. We're in a bad way here. Cujo's in a bad place. God damn it. God damn You're it. You're getting fucked up by a man tyke. <laughs> no. But uh, the episode of. I think it's the episode of Destiny that comes out this week is really. We, we were off the rails on that one. <laughs> it was pretty I can't awesome. I remember which one it is. It, ha it it's it, right at the start. It fucks up. Do you remember? Like I was trying to, I was trying to get it to sync. Oh, yep, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I remember that now. Uh, I can't wait for you guys to see it. What is this? A remoraid. I keep that one. But uh. Oh, this is a thing that randomly evolves into an octopus. Yeah, for some reason. Yeah, no I don't really understand that one. Man time. The big man. One. If you got fucked up by a man type, what was gonna happen against this thing? Just Wait, through. this thing can learn fly? It's a flying type. I didn't think it could learn fly, though. Good thing I fly countered it. Maybe uh, it couldn't in, uh, like, gold and silver, but it can oh, now. God damn it. Maybe. I don't really know. I don't know, to be honest. Oh, uh, this is gonna be a double battle. Let me set up my team really quick. How can that thing learn fly, but Batman can't? Don't question it. Don't question it, man. Have you played the new Batman game, Joel? No, but I've heard good stuff. Yeah, I've good heard stuff. nothing about amazing stuff for it. Um, I really want to play it at some point, but... So much to do, you know? So many games to play. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna Aura Sphere, Meryl, and I'm going to... Meryl! Meryl Kuba! Put the cookie down! <laughs> God damn it, you guys. <laughs> the cookie dog, no! 
So, Joel. Yeah, what's up? What do you think of the, uh, as we're, as our Sinnoh journey comes to a close, how do you feel about the, uh, Sinnoh region as of right now? A lot of badoofs. <laughs> oh, I hate badoofs. That there, there, there are, there are a lot of badoofs. There's like no fucking variety. God, leave Evisor alone, Jesus. <laughs> God, I hate both of you. Get through the chopper. Get to the chopper now. <laughs> Come with me if you want to live. <laughs> All right, so dun, is, this, dun, dun, dun. Is, this, is this whole episode just gonna be fucking honored? I would be Bach. It could be. Oh, I'll be Bach. I'll be black. Oh. It's, uh, <laughs> How you get how you get that? Ah, fuck! I'm out of fucking nuts. <laughs> what? Did, did you have nuts to begin with? Yes, I did. Be sure. Uh, from, to all clarify gone. for people, <laughs> Andy is playing uh, Ocarina of Time on his DS. And I'm and, all out of nuts. And I assume he's talking about Deku nuts. No, I'm talking about the things you shoot out of your fucking. Yeah, those are Deku nuts, right? Oh my you God. shoot out of your slingshot. Are you oh, new? Uh, yeah, I think so. Are those second? No, those I are... think so because they blow up and. What are the bigger people? ones? Chaos. <laughs> Cause I need to get this golden fucking spider. I need to shoot him. So I speaking Fuck. of spiders, I saw this video the other day that like had me cringing. It was like labeled as the biggest nope video of 2015. Oh god. It was a scorpion versus a black widow spider. Fuck that! Yeah, I was Well fuck! I watched that. I watched like 20 seconds and I had to turn it off. <laughs> I was talking to, I was talking to a coworker of mine, and they, they like dislike spiders so much, like you, you couldn't pay them a million dollars to have a spider on their lap. Like a tarantula? Yeah. You know, see, like, I hate, like, normal spiders I find in my house. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like spiders. I, I wouldn't mind a tarantula. That's the weirdest fucking thing I've ever heard. Really? Yeah. Because most, pe most people are, like, the small ones they don't give a shit about, but the fucking tarantulas are fucking no. No, no, because, like, the small ones I lose. Like, I lose track of them. I lose well, What are they going to do to you? Like a bite. They could, but a bite from a small one doesn't hurt as much as a bite from a b fucking tarantula. You don't know that. I do know that! Do you know? That's just science! Tarantulas... Science! Tarantulas' bites are about the same as a bee sting. And that's a fact. Well, that still hurts. Blinded me with but science. I, but I don't, but I don't, think, I don't think the small one's bites feel like bee stings, though. They could be, they more, definitely they could be more venomous. Smaller scorpions are way more deadly it's than just, a huge motherfucker. It's just like... It's and just, that's true. Everyone knows that's true. It's, science! It's, science! It's, How does it work? But it's just like a creep factor, you know? Like, yes. tarantulas are my, like, least favorite thing ever just because they're so creepy. No, mm -hmm. I can, like, I can see a tarantula. I won't lose it. Like, have you ever had that panic moment where you see a spider on the wall and you're oh, yeah. See, I think, I think, like... Like, uh, what the fuck kind of spider is that? Will it jump on me? Will it kill me? Uh, I think my fear of spiders... Oh, I got the hiccups. It's so unprofessional. God damn it, you suck. Will you get your shit together? Yeah, oh, I'm sorry, sorry guys. Will you get your shit together? <laughs> <laughs> um, I, uh, I think it was because, like, as a kid, I watched a lot of stuff with, like, big spiders. But it wasn't, like, it wasn't, like, Lord of the Rings big spider. It was, like, real spiders, just big. Ugh, fuck that. So, like, because like, I remember specifically there was one episode of Power Rangers where one of them gets, like, shrunk down and, like, the bad guy, like, throws him in, like, a cage with a spider. But it was like a tarantula, and like that scared the shit out of me. My like I could, I could do tarantula. I, yeah. I can't do king scorpion. Yeah, fuck that. Honestly, fuck like, both of it. I know, I know. Scorpion, like the scorpions, when they're bigger, they're less venomous, so they're yeah. not as dangerous. But yeah. like, just the way they look. Right. Let's just go this way. Oh, where the fuck am I going? You, you just missed it. What are you talking about? You go up to where you were. Yep. Okay, pop another repel. I'm sweating. Every time, huh? Yeah. Every time. So you go up to like the island you were standing on. We go up you here. Go up and around. Oh, I see. Because I I didn't see that we could surf here. Um, can I tell you about like a weird irrational fear I have, Joel? Um. All right, just tell Joel. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to know or anything. Hey, you're kind of in the room. Yeah. Doesn't matter. It wasn't directed towards me. So do I? Can I tell you guys? Hey, you about... want to talk shit about Andy? <laughs> <laughs> can I tell you guys about a uh, weird, irrational fear that I have? 
When yes. you piss in the toilet, you're scared it'll come out the sink. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we already talked about that yeah, in an episode. Of, episode of this. <laughs> but no. Sharks in the swimming pool? No. Um, sand on the potato salad? Uh, they got sand in the potato salad! <laughs> When I when I go out to like when I'm like in a when I'm driving and I'm in like a plaza and I go to like take a left out so I have to wait for the light. It took I, me three days to make that potato salad. <laughs> three I, I have, days. I have an irri- irrational fear that if someone's like coming to the red light, they're not gonna stop and they're gonna t-bone me. <laughs> like I just I, it's like my mind goes there every time and I don't understand why. It could happen. It could. They're not popping. Oh, he's level forty-nine. You just never know anymore. People just don't know how to drive. That's what I'm saying. Especially because you get the driving school, which graduates like every six months. Yeah. yeah. So that's the worst part. Yeah, for you, for guys who don't know, we have a driving school in town. We have like two <laughs> driving schools in town. Oh, that's horrible. That uh, like they have like, what is it? What did you say it was? That they graduate it's every like six months. Every six months, there's new drivers on the road. Well, they all think they're hot shit. Yeah, of course. Oh, I just got my license. Oh my god. Oh god. This thing have just, an electric type move now. Right? This, this thing this thing just had a dragon dance. Oh, I need to buy more nuts. It's okay. Again, you had no nuts to begin with. No. I still have no nuts. Hashtag Andy has no nuts in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Do I have nuts now? Well, where did I get these nuts? <laughs> These nuts! <laughs> <laughs> Got him! Got him! God damn it. <laughs> Alright, we're going up the waterfall, Joel. On a Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> we're going up. Uh, that was good one. On a Tuesday. Shut up. No. Just just shut up. I don't I don't like you. You guys ever gone up on a Tuesday? No one? No? Okay. <laughs> up where? You know, just in up the attic? Up. We have a raccoon that lives in our attic. What? Yeah. When did that happen? I don't know. <laughs> I came back and my roommate like showed me a picture and he's just like, dude, check this out. It's a set of eyes in our attic. I'm like, what the fuck is that? He's just like, it's a raccoon. We named it Betsy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we are now in Victory Road. This isn't a road. The last stretch. This is a cave to the uh, to the Pokemon League. Anything good in here aside from Bidus? That's probably just gravelers and stuff like that. I'm yeah, not 100 percent sure, but I don't. They got lazy in this place. I I concur. But yeah, we have a raccoon named Betsy, a gopher named Gary, Max, Gary. And, Max and Ruby are two rabbits that I see every morning, and there's a cat. You haven't named the cat yet. Should name the cat Missile. What? Name the cat Missile. Why would I name the cat Missile? Why? Why is that more ridiculous than anything else that you could come up with a cat name? Name it Nipples. <laughs> nipples. Yeah. Why Nipples? Ah, uh, sounds like a cat name. What do you mean? It sounds like a cat name. Come here, Nipples. Am I wrong? I mean, I guess, I guess, I guess, uh. I guess Missile is more of a dog name, right? Probably, yeah. Yeah. I would name a dog Missile. That's nice. I'd name a dog Fred. Why? I don't know. Why not? Yeah, why not? I guess. If we go by that logic. <laughs> I'd love I'd love some, to see someone with just like a, a ridiculously absurd dog name like Cunt Punter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's just like, just uh, like something like that, you know. Interesting choice. Shit bucket. Yeah, <laughs> shit bucket. Something like that. Oh, so there's species a... cannon. <laughs> <laughs> there's a philosophy teacher like in my uh, that teaches at my school. Yeah. And he had he had an essay like a final essay type thing do, and the question the the topic of the essay was why. That was the only question. Why. Right. And. So everyone like writes like ten page papers like explaining why, like it, it didn't even know what they were writing about, like why sure. shit happens or something like that. There was one kid who thought he'd be a funny fucking asshole. He just wrote why not, and, and the philosophy teacher took it, and it was an A. <laughs> <laughs> he got an A for writing why not. I mean, smart Pro- man. Probably because like he thought it was funny. Um, 
recently, uh, we were showed by a friend of ours that uh, one of his professors got a. Uh, oh right, yeah. Got an email from one of his students. He says that was from Nick. Shout out he, to Nick. Yeah, shout out to Nick. Um, he uh, he got a he got a uh, fucking uh, email from one of his kids saying he wouldn't be in class because uh, so, uh, he, he, all of his left shoes have been stolen. Uh, so he can't like he, he would like normally get someone else's shoes, but nobody in his dorm has like size fourteen shoes. Seventeen. Seventeen shoes. So he's not gonna run to the class with one shoe on, and like the teacher was like, "That's probably the best excuse I've ever heard." You would, yeah. Which is which is funny because like you know that's like a prank that his friends pulled on him. Oh yeah. Because like if you have a ob- obnoxiously large feet like that, you're not gonna find anybody else. No. So that's I have like issues trying prank. to find my shoe size. But anyway. what shoe size are you? Thirteen and a half. Wow. Well, you know what they say about shoe size, Joel? I'm a twelve. Yeah, I know. Okay. You're 12? Yeah. Oh, loser. I think you have bigger feet than me. I think I'm like 11. What can I say? Alright, it's not, it's, not, it's not that big. I got big size. 12, 12, 12, 12, size 12 foot is not that big. Hey. <laughs> hey, listen. I'm listening. I got nothing. Okay. Alright, all right, right, cool. yeah. Thanks Good for wasting our time, Andy. Good talk, yep. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's, uh. You suck! God damn it! Sorry. <laughs> ah! God damn it, I am here on business. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a. Who dead, did this to us? That's a dead reference. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's a good one. God uh, damn it, who did this to us? Oh, do we need fucking rock smash? Are you kidding me? Please God tell me we don't need rock Damn it, smash. I am here on business. <laughs> uh, Please uh, tell me we don't need rock smash. I'll be so upset. We don't need Rock Smash. I will be so upset. I will be upset and discouraged multiple times. Upscouraged. Upscouraged. Oh. We got Torment! Yay? No. Okay. It's useless. You're useless. Thanks. Someone at Nintendo spent a lot of time making that move. It just makes you not be able to use the same move in a row. That could be useful. It could be, but not in like not for us. Therefore, I don't care. Rude. Hey, look, it's got a Gengar. God damn it. Oh god. Okay. Bye, Gengar. Bye. What the fuck did they make him park poison? You know. So useless. I'm sorry, Joel. Oh god. Imprisoned might actually. Oh, stop it! Stop this! So now we know we can't use Combine because he used uh, Imprison. Because Imprison, like, we can't use moves it, it has. I don't know what it just did. You missed. No, but before that. It looked like he used Future Sight, but I'm not sure. It was Future Sight. <laughs> well, <laughs> great. You're terrible! Shut up! Why would you not go out to a dark type? Because this outspeeds speeds and I want to give it the experience. Oh, okay. Fair enough. <laughs> okay, so I think we're going to investigate the fact of whether we need Rock Smash or not uh, between episodes. So we're going to end off uh, today's episode here. If you guys like the episode, hit the like button and subscribe for more. But while you do that, we're going to get out of here. Bye. Have a good day or night, depending on where you are. Bye. Bye.